What's good, y'all? Sweet Empress Lives. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, if you are returning, what's good, my loves? This is going to be for Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as North Node. Thank you so much for all the likes, the shares, the subscribes. I truly appreciate y'all. If you would like to follow me on Instagram, that's at the Empress Lives. And make sure y'all hit that subscribe button if it resonates for you. But let's go ahead and get into it. So I feel like some of you guys um, could be returning to an ex, a lover, a family member, or a friend, all right, or this could have happened during the retrograde, all right, um, or this person could have, you know, returned to you, definitely getting, uh, it didn't work, okay, so I feel like something could have stopped you from working or stagnated you from um, putting in work in the studio or putting in work towards an endeavor or a business, I feel like this could have been heartbreaking to you here, all right, I'm um, definitely getting the return of an ex, a lover, a friend, um, you know, during the the retrograde could have definitely caused you some type of surprise heartbreak all right i feel like it could have also um caused you some type of mental imprisonment as well because it also could have uh, brought up old fears um old anxieties so i'm definitely getting uh panic attacks or anxiety attacks some of you guys could have dealt with um some type of depression here in the release in, uh, in the recent past yeah, you release. I feel like this was somebody that you already had previously released or, um, you know, somebody that you had let go of. But I feel like you allowed this person to return and it could have uh, caused your own heartbreak here. All right. So I feel like you guys knew this uh, was someone that had already broken your heart in the past. Yeah, I'm definitely getting um, you. You could have been told this, but you could have thought someone was lying to you about something not working with this person. But I'm getting now you're saying that uh, this person wasn't lying to you. All right, so another air sign could have told you that, you know, something wasn't going to work out with you returning to a friend or a family member or, or an ex. All right, yeah, but I feel like whoever told you this is just, uh, you know, deciding to back away from the situation or not deal with the grief of the situation here. All right, um, you know, but I'm definitely getting someone wasn't lying to you. All right, you could be dealing with someone with the first or last initial I or yeah, I, A or Q. Let's see. All right. Yeah, I feel like you guys weren't ending some type of cycle here. I feel like that's why you guys were stuck or that's why you guys haven't been able to put in work towards a business or an endeavor. All right. Um, because I feel like uh, every time you guys return to your past here, it always brings you into uh, some type of, of, of block or instability here as far as, you know, whatever it is that you are working towards a relationship, a business. All right. For some of you guys, it's a true love here. I feel like you guys um, aren't ending some type of cycle. All right. Um, and you're causing some type of drama here in your relationship relationship or you know in a, in a true love pair situation because it, you're not allowing a door to close here okay with someone from your past that you already know it's not going to work out with but I feel like um you know someone uh could have told you that it wasn't going to work out and you just didn't want to believe this person all right yeah I'm definitely getting someone could have returned who you uh, were married to or someone could have returned after you got married all right to mentally abuse you so I'm definitely getting an ex all right um this could be a friend as well but yeah i feel like uh this person could have returned because they saw that you were married all right i feel like this person was purposely trying to stop you from getting in the uh in the studio or stop you from working towards something yeah keeping you confused all right um you know mentally conflicted i'm definitely getting uh this could be someone who is doing spell work all right yeah this person wants you to stay lack-minded it could be a leo aries sagittarius um, yeah, I'm definitely getting somebody told you about this, though, but, you know, you could have definitely thought that, you know, your person was lying to you. All right. Um, yeah, but I feel like now you realize that you are being lied to by a fire sign or an earth sign. All right. This person was definitely causing you misery on purpose because they know that you're destined to be wealthy. Um, that's why this person doesn't want to end a cycle with you. All right. But yeah, I feel like you guys could have been confused here believing someone uh, who returned. Yeah, I'm getting an immature fire sign, period, point blank. Um, so it could be a Leo specifically. All right. Um, yeah, I feel like this person is stuck on you or um, you feel stuck even though you've manifested a true love here. Um, but you feel stuck because you're allowing drama uh, to to block your happiness or it's like drama in the middle of your happiness here. Um, I feel like you are going to release uh, being in and out with your person. OK, because I feel like you're going to see the truth uh, clearly that they were telling you the truth about this person. All right. Um, yeah, I'm getting that you are going to release this player energy in your life here it could definitely be a younger fire sign or an immature fire sign a taurus a scorpio a leo 
All right. Um, yeah, I feel like because you guys continue to stall a connection here, um, when I feel like you guys need, you already know that you're not, uh, you need to cut someone off or no longer communicate with someone here. Yeah, I feel like you are going to release the illusions here, um, you know, once you gain your self-worth uh, back here, because I feel like... Um, returning to this person or allowing this person to return to you brought you back in a confused state or um you know just be feeling blocked or feeling stuck all right um yeah but i feel like it's blocking your uh, your destiny here it's blocking your creativity it's blocking you from doing something that you're destined to do here um as well as a true love i'm definitely getting your person still loves you all right but i feel like you guys keep allowing drama to come into your energy here or into your connection um or into your marriage for some of you guys because you guys are stuck on someone okay who's uh who's causing drama yeah i'm definitely getting you guys are going to move forward okay i feel like you are going to move on from this situation um or on you're going to move on from this drama here and it is a good decision i feel like you guys are going to make a decision um to you know um lay, lay a situation to rest here because i'm definitely getting uh remain calm your dreams are coming true right in front of you here you are going to get a yes in the immediate future here all right um but i feel like somebody could be trying to get your attention or trying to hold on to your attention okay an earth sign capricorn taurus virgo this could be a younger earth sign uh as well as a uh, a fire sign a leo aries sagittarius i'm definitely getting an air sign could even be stalking you guys all right so multiple people here could uh be feeling alone they could feel the loss of you here um but i'm i'm getting that your person was not lying to you about about these people or these energies returning it's not going to work all right um because all they do is bring in drama here or bring in drama in your life and that uh blocks you from being able to put in work towards uh your destiny all right yeah, because I feel like you are destined to uh, have success in a business endeavor here, all right, but you guys need to release a Gemini or a Cancer. Some of you guys could have, uh, you know, felt weak or felt um, weakened by a, a karmic here, okay? I feel like this person could be African or have African roots. I'm definitely getting this person could have been used to torturing you or tormenting you, all right? I'm definitely getting a dangerous uh, connection. I, I, I just heard a fatal, a fatal attraction. Okay, so somebody could have definitely told you this person was a fatal attraction or that they were a stalker, all right, that they were preventing you from, um, you know, success in a business endeavor here. Yeah, I feel like, um, you know, this person uh, makes you weak or this person makes you think weak minded. All right. Yeah, I feel like you keep trying to justify holding on to this connection or this situation here, but they're dangerous, period. It's a, it's a dangerous connection. Yeah, I'm definitely getting you guys are going to realize uh, that you need to deny this person. Okay, it could be a Leo or a Sagittarius. I'm definitely getting a hater, uh, somebody that's a hater. All right, somebody's hating on you because uh, you're loyal to your passion, you're loyal to your person. All right, yeah, I feel like some of you guys, uh, you just need to change your beliefs here to shift your energy because I'm getting, you already know they're dangerous, all right? Somebody wasn't lying to you about this person being dangerous, uh, you know, for you, all right? Um, I feel like you guys are definitely destined to have success in, a, uh, in an endeavor here. Yeah, good, yes, this is a, a good business venture here. You will have success, okay? But I feel like you guys have been trying to ignore the, uh, the fact that a karmic has been stopping you from forward movement here. Yeah, I'm definitely getting your person still loves you, okay? They still see you as loving and kind. They just feel like you just don't get it, okay? Uh, yeah, I feel like whoever you're in a relationship, they, they know that you love them, they know that you're caring and generous, but they feel like you just don't get it, that you keep allowing karmics uh, to return to your energy and you don't realize that's what's actually blocking you from putting in work uh, towards an endeavor, towards a studio. Yeah, I feel like, um, you know, you guys are gonna, are, are gonna realize this person was being honest to you, okay? I feel like your person's not even uh, surprised, all right? Yeah, I feel like you need to use wisdom but release being defensive, so you don't have to block everybody off, but you do need to use wisdom about who you are allowing in your energy because sometimes if you ignore all right because ignorance is just ignoring uh ignoring what you know or ignoring uh, the truth about someone or something so i feel like if you guys ignore um excuse me yeah i'm definitely getting these people want to silence you all right yeah use wisdom okay uh regarding whoever is trying to return to your energy at this time but that's all i got for you now till next time